hello everyone welcome to this new video oh my god it's so exciting i haven't vlogged i was gonna say filmed but then i said vlog it still said vlog anyways i haven't vlogged in like five months i haven't posted anything on youtube i don't even know what to say um yeah i felt like coming back after korea you know my life was kind of boring um i've just been working a lot and not really doing much. I mean, the COVID situation in Canada is not that great. We can't even go see our families. We're not allowed to go to other people's homes. Um, that's the situation. And they just started doing mandatory, mandatory masks like a month ago. Maybe two months ago. But like, they should have done that from the beginning. Anyways, it's um, not that great. Um, and it's actually my day off today, but I decided to go out. Um, I never usually go out, but... Um, I need to stock up on some stuff and I decided I should take you guys with me because the one of the places I want to go to is art box Yes, there's an art box here in Canada. That's so crazy. But anyways, it's gonna be super fun and Yeah, just want to show you I guess around I Guess what a day would be like. I don't know. I'm just gonna vlog today and see where this day takes me. Oh By the way, it's so shaky because I'm not actually using my Canon G7X, I'm using my new phone, which is the iPhone 11. I upgraded from an iPhone 6. It's been a long time coming. It's been like six years. Six? So I had the iPhone 6, and I couldn't vlog with it because it wouldn't record any sound. So that's why I got the G7X. Sean gave me a new phone, which was a 6S+, Plus, which, I mean, it wasn't like... A new new version so I've only had that one for like two years maybe but there's no memory on it seriously like everything I every time I try to take a picture or film something it says I can't so and the quality was super bad so I just upgraded we both did because he had an iPhone 6 as well <laughs> but he got the Samsung Galaxy S20 yeah he really wanted to switch back to Samsung so he did that and um, I think I need to get a tripod for this so I can hold it steady because it's like pretty shaky, but yeah, I like the quality and stuff so far. It's so weird to be filming. It's so nice to like see you guys. Leave a comment below if you're still watching in 2021. Wow. Guys, I really hope 2020, like, I really hope we have a great 2021. Let's just say that. And let's go. It is super rainy because it's Vancouver, Vancouver. Um, let me show you. Oh, that's a picture. So I got some really dirty windows here, but um, that's my kind of view. I'll show you guys a tour in another video, but yeah, rainy, not a surprise. <laughs> to the SkyTrain station. Yes, we call it SkyTrain and not subway. <laughs> so it takes like five minutes to walk. into two different like malls or like buildings so this is Aberdeen Center and then there's Aberdeen Mall actually we'll go to one of my favorite places in the Aberdeen Center which is this like claw machine land it's just really aesthetic <laughs> This was $45 and then you get 255 points and each machine has, oh, like this one costs 15 points. So let's see which one I want to do. So it has such cute stuff inside, but I don't know if I can get it. This one's so close, but it's so heavy. I 
I think we're getting into a weird area here. actually freaking out right now i never went in this place and oh my freaking god okay i shouldn't say never i did one last time but oh my god i'm so happy let me show you what i got i needed i needed a bag to carry everything where can i show you i only wanted to spend it was like 20 dollars for the first the first amount you only got like a hundred credits, but I just did the um, I did the next the next one up, which was forty five dollars, and you actually get two hundred fifty five. So you get way more tokens, and I wasted like a hundred on that stupid unicorn thing that I couldn't even move. I can't wait to show you the ones that I actually got. <laughs> so now I'm just walking over to Aberdeen Mall, and we're gonna go to Art Box. Town here and there's also Giordano. While I'm here I think I'm gonna grab something to eat because I haven't had lunch yet. And this place has like the best food court. Sorry I couldn't remember that word for a second. Let me show you. Oh my god they took all the seating away. Oh my god you can't even eat over here anymore. It's the waiting zone. Oh my god this is so different. I haven't been here in so long so I had no idea what the situation was like because of COVID. Looking real slim. Oh my gosh. That used to be Snowy Village, like the Bingsu place and now it's Yogurt King. Interesting. That's so weird. I don't know what I want to eat. I don't know if I'll eat here anymore. The small is shaped really weird because you have to go down this escalator. But to get to the bottom floor, you have to actually walk around and then go down those escalators. Hmm. Anyways, I want to show you Candyland as well as Art Box. There's actually a long lineup in Candyland, so I don't want to go there. But we will definitely go to Art Box. Oh my god, I'm so excited! <laughs> Somehow spent $65 in there, so when I get home, I will show you what I got. Hey guys, I'm home now. Um, before I turn into a full-on Lay's potato chip, I'm gonna show you guys what I got from our box as well as the claw machine store. I don't know what that place is called actually. I'm sure there's a name. Okay, so I guess the name is Oct Octmon. I don't know what that means, but yeah, Claw Cream Store. I think it was called something else before, but anyways, um, let me show you what I got. Yes, I had to get this gigantic bag. Okay, sorry for this angle, but I don't have a tripod for my phone yet, so. Okay, so the first thing is this hairpin. Look how cute it is. I don't know it was a hairpin, actually. Sorry if you can hear the dogs. Oh, they stopped. From the Lion Friends, oh my gosh, BT21. And then the next one I got was this one. Oh my god, so cute. It's from Card Captor, I'm pretty sure, right? I was like almost gonna get this one, but I had done it like two times, I think, and then 
I thought she was giving me advice on how to like where to move the joystick or whatever. And then she opened the thing and put it so that it was like pretty much gonna fall. What? Like that was so nice. So yeah, I got this one. But then right after I moved this, right after I moved this one, this one was seriously hanging on by thread as well. So I was like, okay, I had enough tokens for this one too, and I got it. This one is so cute. It's little Dratini, I think that's the name, right? OG Pokemon. So cute. So cute. So then I won these and I'm like, uh, didn't really think that I was gonna win anything. Oh, I just noticed the tail on him. <laughs> so cute. Yeah, I didn't think I was gonna win anything. Like I just wanted to do it for fun. Um, do it for the vlog. So then I got that big bag. Um, so then I had these two and then I asked her how many tokens I had left because I had that card and she said I had 15. So I just checked for one more um, that costs 15 and yeah, got this little watermelon. So freaking cute. So I was actually so lucky, so lucky. I will link the other videos of when I went there. I think I went there twice. I don't remember. I think I did win actually the other two times too, but I think it was my brother who won. Um, anyways, yes, that was really fun. And now I will show you the stuff I got from Artbox, which was my main purpose of this trip. Okay, so they gave me this really cute bag. So first of all, I got these two notebooks. So cute. This one is a hard hardcover and looks like the coil ring. Don't know what I'm gonna use this for yet, but I'm probably gonna find a purpose for it for the new year. And I love the color. I love this kind of color. So and this one's cute. It just says. I got two keychains. One is for my friend though, so I don't want to show you guys. Um, but this is the one I got for myself. It's the, um, shoot, what is her name? Esther, is it Esther Bunny? I think that's her name. Um, I used up all my tape for Christmas, so I just got this one because it was on sale. It was $1.50. Really cute. And then I got freaking so many stickers. Okay, not so many, but yeah, I, the one I, first one I got is, oh. I get got Esther Bunny. That was two fifty, and then I got this one. This one was three seventy five for these ones, and then I got this one, which I think I've already. Oops, sorry, I didn't know that was a thing. Um, and then I got this one, which I bought a few of these when I was in Korea. Um, like bigger versions though. Was it Korea? I think it was Korea. Um. But yeah, this was three dollars. And then I got this one. I think this one is more like this one's similar to washi tape, but it's stickers. And then I got one more, but I think it's it's gonna be for my friend for her gift, so I don't want to show you guys. Then I got oh, I got a cute little gift bag because my friend's birthday's coming up. So cute. Seriously, our box has the cutest stuff. Um, and then I got washi tape. All of these for five dollars. In Korea, I feel like this would have been a lot more, but I think there was a, must have been a sale on these or something. So cute! It's the morang. Morang, and then one more. I got um, sticky notes. Seriously, I was so happy today because I was in my zone. In Korea, I would have always been going to stationery stores and grabbing stickers and notepads. So this made me really happy today. Um, so this is the last one last thing I got and this was only $3.50 so not only $3.50 but the price was um yeah wow that really added up all of this and this and the keychain and the bag was $65 that was my little haul of the day thank you so much for watching um if you have any recommendations on what kind of videos you want to see for 2021 please leave them below and i will try to do them because i don't have that many ideas like i do i have a few ideas but yes my main goal is to try to get a one video out per week one video a week um if i have more then that's better but at least one per week so yes i'm really looking forward to this new year and i hope 2021 treats all of us well Peace out 2020. You will not be missed. Thank you for watching. Bye.
Lady, lady, come here, let me tell you something 